Yes, they do. Yes, yes they, they do. do. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have an interesting video. I am going to be debuting my 180SX on base for the Misawa International Car Show. And we just got the 180 back. It is finally here at the Auto Hobby. I am in the process right now of getting the fenders put on, switching the wheels because we're not debuting it on these wheels. A lot has to go in. The car's got to get washed. The car's got to get detailed inside. I had to bolt the seat down. There's so much that's going on right now. It's insane. So it's Thursday. The car show's on Sunday. And there's a lot to do with very little time. Major shout out to Donnie from Pinker Style. Uh, he got the car running. Did all the, the fab work for it. And I just want to, you know, say massive thank you to Donnie from Pinker Style. Um, if any of you are here in the Misawa area watching this and you want to get, you know, performance done, performance work done to your car or, you know, dyno pulls, anything, go ahead, hit up Donnie um, at PinkoStyle.com. I'm really excited. Enough of me talking. We're going to skip to tomorrow because we're getting ready to close up here at the Auto Hobby. Car is finally back on base. We're going to get some major work done to it. I'm excited. Aero kit's going to go on. <clears throat> and yeah let's get it all right guys so we are here at the auto hobby shop it's the next day i have the 180 inside the shop with me um essentially i'm going to be dropping these wheels that are on the car as we mentioned yesterday <clears throat> i am not going to be driving with them to the show i'm going to be displaying a different set <clears throat> so usually i would use my own set of wheels <clears throat> but i actually have someone special that's coming um, and we're going to display their wheels and yeah, I'm actually really excited for this So um, when they get here, we'll throw the camera on and we'll go from there So yeah, so let's get it How to hop in uniform real fast because I am going into work shortly But someone just arrived, let's see who it is What's going on Donnie? How you doing brother? Dropping off these uh, wheels, you guys always see it like one thing man you guys have been on here a few times man i'm not a delivery guy so <laughs> man, but anyway man i'm not a delivery guy only reason this is happening because again jared's drama mine and um yeah he got the show coming up well if it, hopefully it doesn't rain and everything yeah. so he's gonna be out there so again for the guys who don't know this is a uh Panko style ps m915 s mono forge um, i also have the uh, two piece that you see on s2000 and three piece bridge that's coming so these are more tailored for drifters because they're single piece they're cheaper and uh, they're better to bang up versus a two-piece, three-piece wheel. Uh, unless you got the cash to swing that, mm. you know, you drop a, you drop a, you know, you drop a tire in a ditch, man. That's a, that's a big fix. Yep, that Good one thing, hurts. Though, is a two-piece, so you can just take out the front, you know, the front, of, you know, whichever part that breaks and replace that. So I can't get parts and everything. So again, man, I, I don't want to talk too much, man. I always talk with you. So again, these are starting at about 5:30, which is the average for a Mono Forge uh, 6061 T6. I mean, it's, it's very strong will, the jail dogs searching on the DI search and all stuff like that. So, um, yeah, man, you, brought, you, dri you drove on the, um, I think you had the I drove, Yeah, I drove on the two-piece when I had the Mark II, yeah. And the tires that are on here are the, uh, the, the Zinc Nova Z New. I've been running these a bunch, man. Um, I've run them at Sakuba. I drifted on them. They're pretty good to around about 480, 500 horsepower. Right after that, you need, like, the the Molinos and stuff like that because you feel this burn through these. So they're, right. you know. It's all the tires are different, man. So, yeah, yeah man, so for sure. Already.
All right, guys, so it is the next day. I haven't picked up the camera today because we've been on a super time crunch and it's just been a mess. I had work today. I even have work tonight. We have to drop the 180 off tonight at the E-Club. It's just been a mess. It's been nonstop crazy. I need to go ahead and get this car done. But so far what we have done is we have already mounted the bucket seat in the car. The stickers are in the car. Shout out to Big D's, D's coating. Um, you know, obviously they do the powder coating on the car um, and the roll cage and all that other good stuff. Pinko style, obviously, with the PS01 TS coilovers and the PSM 915S wheels. Shout out to them. They actually dropped off, uh, Donnie dropped off the model block wheels to me yesterday and they look really good. When the car gets out of the shop, I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you guys. But first, we need to wash this thing because it looks filthy. So, um, yeah. Also, major shout out to Cheeseburger Racing. They're the ones that always get the drone footage for us at the track. And yeah, still a little minor thing. We've got a bunch of crap in the pack that I'm going to take out and take home with me because tomorrow we obviously have the car show. Papa Mike's gonna be there tomorrow. Mike, Mike, Mike. Oh my gosh. So yeah, and then uh, last but not least, take the hood off because we're going to be displaying the engine bay tomorrow. Um, not much to see, but obviously we do have the um, these coating um, valve cover that they did for us. And yeah, I'm excited. This car's got no radiator and I can't leave it running for too long. It, the hose isn't hooked up. So can't leave it hooked up for too long. And I'm not sure how much gas I have either. So anyways, that's what we've done. Obviously, uh, kit is on. Uh, shout out to David. He gave me his uh, fenders. We mocked them up as best as we could. Don't look at it too much. It's uh. Anyways, <laughs> um, that's good. Front bumpers on. This is what came with the car last time. And yeah, just gotta get this car done, and we're good to go. Also, let me know what you guys think about these red and blue wheels. It's the Puerto Rico edition uh, model blocks from Pico Style. Let me know what you guys think about it. And just like that, the 180 is washed. We're gonna get ready to go load it up onto the trailer, um, onto the flatbed and take it over there. I am beyond excited, super happy. I'm gonna be able to display this car for the first time. Uh, words, words can't describe how excited I am. And I'm just looking forward to this. Uh, looking forward to showing off my passion to the base populace and obviously um, showing off my like Puerto Rican, you know, American taste. Uh, to the Japanese population that'll be coming to the base. We're expected over 130,000 people tomorrow uh, in attendance and I'm beyond excited. This car looks like I don't even recognize it anymore, man. Like I'm gonna put a clip of what it looked like before when we first got it um, in that shed that it was in, like from back then to now, like I, it's been less than a year. The car is, you know, running under its own power. Like, ah, I can't, I can't, you know, I'm lost, for, I'm gonna lost for words right now. I'm beyond happy, I'm beyond grateful, and just super ecstatic. Uh, we're gonna go ahead, load this up on the trailer, and go park it at the E-Club. Nice. Let's get it, guys. So we've got the Comp 180 here. Just dropped it off here at the Misawa Club. Super excited. We are going to be displaying it tomorrow morning. Super happy. Um, and yeah, shout out to all the sponsors. Shout out to everyone, uh, you know, letting this happen. And yeah, let's, uh, let's go put some smiles on people's faces tomorrow. Good morning. Oh my gosh, the hair's a mess. All right, guys. So bright and early morning. It is probably like 5, 6 a.m. right now. Um, I'm extremely tired right now. Like words cannot <laughs> describe how exhausted I am. But we are here at the Misala Club. We have the 180 here on display. I'm super happy, super excited. Um... Yeah, I, I don't have much words. Last night I got off work at midnight and then, yeah, woke up at four o'clock this morning. And yeah, cars are here. So we have the 180 comp car. We have Donnie's S13 Sylvia comp car as well. And as you guys can see, we have a bunch of supercars behind us. Bunch of cars. 
Lots of cars here in attendance today. Still more rolling in right now at the moment. A lot of guys that came down from down south from Tokyo, Yokohama area. Um, and yeah, a lot of beautiful cars here today. I must say, like this, this, this thing is nice. This, this thing is very beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. I think it's just, man, clean, man. I'm loving it. But anyways, uh, yeah, I'll pick the camera back up in like another 10, 15 minutes and yeah, go from there. guys so we uh Donnie and I kind of got some VIP seating and we are actually right here in front of the big jumbotron right here both cars and uh yeah just gotta say awesome turnout bunch of people back here lots of cars enjoying it out here you know how we do Alright guys, so right now we're getting ready to do the awards. Um, hopefully I got the booby prize. Fingers crossed. I really want that booby prize for either car because we're going to be going to Tokyo and Yokohama next week. So we're going to be going to Tokyo and Yokohama next week. People's Choice. And we're going to be going to Tokyo and Yokohama ブービーっていうのはですね、まあ、あの一応ちょっと説明させていただきますと、まあ、最下位から2番目ということになりますね、まあ、ちょっとねでもまあこちら皆さんの方でこちら集めてこっちで審査しましてブービー決まりましたブービー is you ゴンジャレスブービーなさいなさいよ Congratulations, Jared. I'm not going to go to my dasai. It's a video. Oh. 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 All right, win the booby prize. Hell yeah. So, back here, I have Donnie with me. Uh, Donnie, thank you. I had a blast yesterday yeah, at the car show. Good What's time. Sunday. Sunday, yes. Yeah, that's what I did. I was like, oh, I was asleep all day yesterday. Yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, good time. A lot of people showed up. Got to see the live movie movie again. Yeah. Good, good time. So uh, yeah, thank you for letting me follow the wheels for display. Yeah. And yeah, if you guys want to get some monoblocks or two piece wheels from Donnie, go ahead, shoot him an email, Donald at Peepersell.com. Yeah. Right. Three, three piece versions are coming uh, soon here. I got it, I just ordered some myself you guys know my my protocol before i promote anything i have it hands-on so that way i can you know show that it is what it is even though i got the physical which comes and people seeing the quality jared is driven on both both sets and uh but the thing is still like you know when you got stuff you know in hand it just looks better especially i mean people know i'm not a scam scammer but all these guys are right here to do the do, what's that uh, stuff they do now the uh the kickstart and stuff and uh, oh, yeah. all that stuff like hey man we're gonna make like variable piston rotor engine and then like they get all this money and like ah oh, it's too hard dude so yeah. and then money goes away so with that the three-piece versions will all be here once I, as soon as they get those in hand do a video i'll put those out there and um you know just like a lot of people were saying um uh, previously, man, like the color, like you pretty much make everything mold it to yourself. So if you want X, Y, Z, blah, 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 you can build it yourself. So a lot of people are open the same thing. I'm not doing them to reinvent the wheel, but it's my stuff. And I've, I've actually looked at some of the websites and I got more options as far as some people want to fix you in and they don't want to deal. Because it is, it is cumbersome to say, hey, man, I want 
rainbow uh, lug nuts, right? a rainbow stud, someone, this, this, and this. And it's a much to process, but I'm like, yeah, man, I, I, I programmed a white website. And you can go in there, and if you want rainbow studs, it's going to cost you. But you can have fucking every stud a different color or like, you know, whatever, whatever. So yeah. pretty cool stuff, man. And, um, you know, um, yeah, man, I'm just doing it to pretty much have it on my own cars. Uh, if I saw a lot, cool, but the cool thing about it is all my cars have my wheels on it, my brakes, my suspension, and as a shop, I mean, that's kind of cool. And also, wheel suspension and brakes, it doesn't matter what make you got, you all use wheel suspension and brakes. Yep. You know what I mean, so uh, that makes it easier for me to, versus making an S13 part, um, then making a JZX part. They've already got that covered, man. A lot of guys got this stuff covered, so I'm not trying to reinvent the wheel things like that so again with that stuff man you guys want wheels good strong wheels i'm going to actually do a uh, somewhat of a test dummy video and sacrifice a set of wheels and i'm, I'm going to try to break them on camera live like i'm going to do wheel drops in msp with that infill that everybody smacked before and it's trying to destroy them man i'm going to get a car that i don't care about i'd rather not break one of my good cars uh because arms and shit get spent on there so i will be doing like a because i mean the ratings are good i know they're strong but when you see like damage happening happening Know, wheel drops running into this running over stuff running over rocks and you'll know hey man it's good stuff so seeing is believing and uh also with a lot of the stuff out there now i mean i'm not gonna put myself my life and my customers on bs man uh, this is not how i roll uh but uh yeah man good stuff is coming i'll catch you guys in the next one don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video